Besides General Peck and I, the most honored persons here this evening are the veterans, American and Korean veterans who are with us, who went in harm's way, who gave up everything, who put their lives at risk. You saw some of them in this very, very moving video. If you ever have the chance, get the whole video. I watched it the night before last, the whole thing. It is deeply moving, and by the time you get to the end and you see the sacrifices made by our soldiers, and especially the Marines of the 1st Marine Division as they withdraw from the Chosan Reservoir, you will wonder where such courage comes from. Well, it comes from America. It comes from Korea. It comes from people who believe in freedom and are willing to give their all for freedom. And so I salute all of the veterans who are here this evening, and I thank them for their service to America and to Korea. The Republic of Korea was actually born during the coldest winter of the dedication of these veterans and their fellow United Nations veterans around the world who did their duty under the most difficult, imaginable circumstances. We remember the names of those battles and those places that are forever etched in our memory and in our history books. The Pusan Perimeter, Incheon, Heartbreak Ridge, the Chosin Reservoir, Mig Alley, Pork Chop Hill, to name just a few of these places and battles. As we commemorate this month, the 60th anniversary of the beginning of the war, we salute all who served. We will never forget the service that they performed and what they achieved. You may have noticed one little clip out of the film, and it's a line I picked up after watching the other night, and I used it yesterday when we dedicated a new monument to the Korean war, war veterans in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. And they've always said that this was the forgotten war. But as you heard in the clip, if it didn't go by too quickly, one of those veterans say it's not the forgotten war, it's the forgotten victory. We won, and Korea is safe, free, and a democracy. It is a victory. As we now 